Hey guys, so today I'm bringing you this oil cap that I picked up from Mishimoto. Um, I wanted something, I want to kind of dress the engine up a little bit. I thought the first thing to do would put an oil cap on it. So I got this one here, really excited about it. Let me take out the package here and show you guys. So guys, this is the, it's the aluminum cap. You can see it's silver and then it has that flat black in the middle, which I like. Something subtle. I like kind of go like monochromatic theme here see it has a nice o-ring here and it fits the threads perfectly and mishimoto makes some great stuff this is high quality really like it it's heavy it's really heavy so i'm excited to put this on nothing major here of course just my first step in dressing the engine up a little bit but i like the little cutouts here too so it makes it easy when you turn it, it has some cutouts for your finger so let's go ahead and go put this on the car and see what it looks like Okay guys, so it's kind of basic here, what you have to do. So let me go ahead and take this out of the package and we'll go ahead and make the swap and see how it looks. Okay, so of course, first thing is you just take this off. It's a good time to check it, make sure there's no leaks. Look inside there. Looks good. And when you do this, the oil cap doesn't actually, it doesn't hold this cover on, so it should fit real, um, real nice in there. It's like the same size, so. so go ahead and put that down inside there. And a good tip here is to put a little bit of oil on the, the O-ring, because if not, sometimes it, it's got a seat on there really tight and it's gotta be really hard to get it off, but. This is one tip. So if you see here, when it's tight all the way, the push the limit words will be straight up and down. Okay. And what I like to do always put this back in the original box here. That way, what I'm going to do when I take it to the dealer for an oil change, I'm going to swap it just so these guys don't put this somewhere and it falls and gets all chunked up too. So I'll just put the original cap back in too. So I'm going to also do this in gray here. I have some decals coming. I'm going to try that first, and if that doesn't work, I'll just probably plastic it up or paint it. And then I have some wire loom. I'm going to do some gray just to do that monochromatic uh, or silver. Silver is gray and black. I like that. Very simple, but dresses it up a little bit. And I want to get like a gray battery tie down or silver. So I'm going to pick one of those up later on. Just something, nothing crazy here, just to put, get my little touch on it. But I like it. Kind of hard to see because it's recessed so much, but there's plenty of room in there. Get your fingers. Looks really good. One word of advice, because it's metal, it's gonna be really hot when you touch it, when you go take it off, or the other one's plastic. So that's one of the drawbacks to having this. But overall, I like it, guys. Adds that little touch. Um, like I said, nothing major, but I like it. So hope everyone's doing good out there, and I will see you guys on the next one. Thanks, everybody.